On to tonight's big story. Political drama in Carter Lake was intense tonight. Yeah, for nearly 90 minutes, a small town of fewer than 4,000 held a special meeting discussing years of so-called dysfunction in the city. KTV News Watch Simmons, Aaron Hegarty was there. He's live in the newsroom. Aaron. Rob, Julie, Jackie Wall was the focus of that investigation. Four city employees made accusations about the city council member, including that she contacted police in retaliation against one of them, but the investigation found structural changes are needed in the town. First item on the agenda. Disputes in Carter Lake were once again on full display on Wednesday night. You ought to try and do something and put this behind you. Council members narrowly voted not to publicly release an investigation into City Council member Jackie Wall. I'm just confused here. Man. We're elected to represent 3,700 people, not a handful of people. While three of five wanted to discuss behind closed doors instead, they needed four votes to do that. The, the part that bothers me is that she says, I did nothing wrong. The investigation says completely different. No, I said that I didn't think that it justified having the investigation. But in summary, the investigator said Carter Lake has an opportunity to turn a corner. While it found Wall exhibited inappropriate behavior, it said others have been in the wrong too. And to stop the gossip rumors and national, nasty social media posts. There are a lot of good things going on in Carter Lake, but the infighting can do nothing but dilute the many positive experiences. The investigator recommends a reprimand of council member Jackie Wall readopting a 90 day plan from 2022 for the council intended to restore order and productivity and create a city administrator role. They did reinstitute the 90 day plan after some back and forth over the specifics there. It's an easy thing to follow, Jackie. And the other four council members did vote to reprimand Wall. You done? All right, Jaron, thanks for coming out. Wall said the report was a waste of taxpayer dollars. She said she will not be a scapegoat for citywide dysfunction and said she will not resign. She agrees a city administrator should be hired in Carter Lake. Back to you.